Okay, I see the crazy eyes right now. I see that. Yeah, they do look a little crazy. Yeah. I wonder if him the other crazy eyes had a stare down upstairs. That would have been good. See whose eyes were crazier. <laughs> the kid looks like he's coming to fight. They both look like they're coming to fight. Oh, this is going to be good. Look at that. His eyes do look a little crazy. I'm, yeah. I'm going to try not to look at them, but I seem to can't. switching stances right away. I can't help myself. <laughs> <laughs> stare at his eyes now. Yeah, guys that fight like this with an unorthodox style, and they're kind of punching from everywhere. It's, uh, it's hard to time them. It's hard Ooh, to read them. Beautiful up top and down low again uh, by... Adam. Sonny going for the clinch right away. He's got good balance in the, in the clinch, uh, Sonny. Sonny. Oh, nice right elbow there. Good knee. use of the elbow. Did you see that? Made a little distance. It came across with that right elbow beautifully. Well, I really like that. I really like to see fighters utilize the uh, disengaging out of the clinch and use that second distance, whether it be an elbow or throwing a punch. Sonny, right now- Sonny seems like he's finding his rhythm out there. Yeah. He's not afraid to attack. Definitely not. Oh, there goes the elbow There's again. There's another elbow, a nice Keeps right elbow. sneaking him in there. He's, what he's doing is he's going over the top, so he's using his range to kind of just slip it over the top. Remy looks like he's definitely building up some momentum here. Looks like Adam's gonna have to try to play catch up here and get his rhythm going. You see Adam, you know, trying to use his boxing and, and use his footwork uh, coming in and out and going low and high. He's not really setting anything up with the jab. He's just kind of winging the right hand at a hook or throwing a hook. But that it, works exactly. if, it works if you're if the guy's in front of you and he's kind of standing there allowing you to do that. But there was the jab. Didn't move his feet with it. Good low kick attempt, but I, but I feel like... Uh, well, he's not... It's, it's a similar to what you were saying before. He's got to have his, his footing. Uh, before he sets those things up. Nice, none of the nice low kick, inside kick. The elbows over the top and just keep fighting your fight. Yeah. I mean, even that right there, he kind of got in his head. He reached out, you nice know, knee. he accepted the hand touch. But look at this, he's Beautiful aggressive right but awkward. Yeah, it is awkward. You're not really sure what angle he's coming at. And that's the thing. Adam's kind of got his hands locked up by the side of his head. He's looking to get off, but. Nice evasion there. And Sonny, you know, staying in the southpaw uh, position. Oh, hey, nice hey, teep. You know, if Adam's going to play this kind of a game, he's got to go forward. But then every time he goes forward, he gets tied up in the clinch. So it's, it's you know, it's, it's tough. Especially with the Muay Thai rules, if you're not used to it, it, it it's it, tough. And then Sonny's like standing, you know, when he goes in southpaw, it's directly to his side. Sonny, if you time him between the shots, he squares up and he's perfect. He's lined up for a straight right hand right down the middle. See, he oh, kind of nice gets touched. Knee. His head's kind of stuck in the middle. Yeah. You know, if you wait for him to throw and then answer back with a straight punch, then his combination, I think Adam would do a lot better. He's using the shoulder check and elbow. Adam, you know, trying to yeah, knee Sonny, as well. Sonny, Sonny's fun to watch. He's Cross block. Underhook. So trying to figure out a Rubik's Cube. He's, he's Adam doing a good job. Can't quite get it. You can't. Adam doing a good job of, of spinning him, but... Sonny's got his hands on, underneath, so he's Under, able to oh, big in his face. elbow there. Sneaking elbows up the inside. I think he's just more comfortable using the elbows. Yeah. You know, sometimes here in the States, they don't get a, a chance to use them a lot. So, you know, fights in the past, they never got to use them. So Both really guys are doing well in the clinch, though. They're, they're changing dominant positions, they're spinning each other. That's always nice to see. Sometimes you see guys just kind of hold each other. Yeah, no. This, not much this of is a clinch. A, it's just more of a hug. This was a very active clinch. Body kick Adam's lands. bleeding out of the mouth a little bit. I don't know if it's his lip. Yeah, you can see some of the, the marks on the body of, of Adam now. Oh, watch, Sonny's going to push him off and sneak an elbow in there. He, here's, he ties him up in the corner, using his shoulders very well, too, to keep Sonny from uh, being able, from Adam to bring his arms down. Right now, Adam's trying to bring his arm down, and Sonny had that arm locked in the clinch. Ooh, that was an exhausting round. For wide. Punches seem just a tad bit wide. But like I said, he's up. Oh, there we go. He's got this is what he's got to do. He's got he's waiting too long again. He's got to get in there. He's got to keep throwing hands in his face. He's waiting too long. Now he's got to keep going. Instead of two shots, he's got to throw three or four. He's yeah, waiting he, again. You can't pull out with this you guy. Can't, nope, you gotta go because and he, he gotta keep punching, yeah. you gotta keep kicking. You can't wait. We can't pull out because nope. you, and now you gotta keep going. You can't wait. And then he's gotta keep punching. One shot's not gonna catch this kid. 
Two, three, four. It's the second, third generation. It's Tony not the one looks a punch. little tired here, but he's really good at throwing that overhand right elbow. He's, he's not. I like his range. He's got a very good in and out kind of style where he hits right. you and makes you miss. Then he, right. makes, he makes you pay for it. Adams throwing the one shot or two shots and then stopping. And when he walks in, he throws a rise. Sonny throws a rising elbow. Sneaks it right up the middle. Yeah, perfect. I'm looking to see Dan tonight. I, I've seen him fight in the past. He's fun to watch. I don't know too much about Nazim, but from his record, it looks like he's pretty tough. He looked Ooh, pretty confident out there in the lineup. So my money's on. Uh, I think my money's on Dan to win the whole thing. I think so. All right, man. We'll, we'll see. We'll see if you're right. Oh, nice hook! But then he stopped. He's got to. He's got to keep coming. He's got to keep throwing his hands. He can't wait. Go to the body. Go to the head. Now keep punching, kid. Yeah, Adams. Adams. You got to keep really punching, kid, if you want this. Oh, he is right going here. For that's it. His, that's his chance right there. He punches knows. and bunches. You can't throw single shots. Single shots is not going to get the job done. He knows that he has to He's win. He's got to go round. for it. He's waiting. He's got to keep coming. Oh, he is doing a little bit of damage here, though. And he sneaks that head kick, and it could be a. You think nice. that? Oh, spinning elbow. Nice. There it is. See. With ten seconds left to this round. This is fun. Adam is really going for broke here. They're both going for it. I like this. I like that Adam turned it up in the third round. He knew what he had to do, and he went for it. Absolutely. I think Adam might have stole that round, but I think it might be a little bit too late. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we have a winner by majority decision. Judge A sees this in favor of the red corner, 29-28. Judge B sees this fight, 28-29, in favor of the blue. Oh, wow. And lastly, Judge C sees this majority decision. in favor of. Decision? And moving on to the semifinals, Sonny Crazy Eyes C.